I study experiences of basic needs insecurity among college students, which means that students have trouble meeting their basic material needs that are necessary in daily life, things like food and shelter. Needs insecurity affects all types of students at all types of institutions. Today, just over half of students and their families have to devote a quarter or more of their total family income towards the total price of college. The majority of students who are struggling to get enough to eat and find a safe, secure place to live are actually receiving financial aid and working, but it's still not enough to make ends meet. Scarcity theory indicates that we only have so much cognitive bandwidth and when we're worried about near-term scarcities, some of that brain power is distracted thinking about how are we going to meet our daily basic needs rather than how can I prepare for this upcoming test or write this paper. Upwards of one in two undergraduates experience some form of basic needs insecurity. It's really a problem that affects campuses across our nation. According to the College and University Food Bank Alliance, over 700 campuses now have on-campus food pantries to help students who are not getting enough to eat. Countless others are starting meal voucher programs, emergency aid response programs, and all sorts of creative measures to help students meet their basic needs so that they can focus and study and try to meet their educational goals.